the United States. We'll have to see about that. All right, joining me now is a gentleman who uh, you may have seen on YouTube. And uh, he's known as Uncle Sam. And it is Chaffee? Chaffee. Chaffee. John Chaffee of Cleveland, Ohio. He's a Cleveland-based singer and songwriter. Uh, you may be familiar with Play by the Rules. Kevin, do we have that queued up? Yes, we do. Take a look at this and then meet John. <laughs> Every man won't pay his taxes, thieves run through the stores, everybody's laying off, government's hiring more, bribes and payoffs now the norm, freezer full of cash, tape your sex play with a kid, rewrite your shameful past, the governor and the call girl, the preachers and the boys, the insults thrown so carelessly, can't hear for all the noise, respect the Oval Office, get on your knees and play, some footsie in the men's room, and don't care what you say Cut me in, bail me out Failure's not my fault Responsibility, what's that? Just a word, that's all I'm trying very hard To chill and keep my cool I'm trying hard to find someone Who just play by the rules Is there anybody out there Who just play by the rules John Chaffee, ladies and gentlemen, play by the rules. It's a song that's supposed to summon the voices of America that are angry about a whole bunch of stuff going on out there or just plain frustrated or dumbfounded by it all. Let's welcome John into the uh, strategy room today. Welcome. Thank you, Harris. Good uh, morning. Uh, good morning. Tell me about the lyrics in that song. I mean, they all rhyme and they're all funny, but they all have a meaning. Well, it's sort of been bubbling in my mind over the last year or two, and uh, I'd write down a line or two here or there, and uh, as more things happened, and as more bad behavior happened, and more scandals, and and then they named a, a treasury secretary, a guy that couldn't even figure out his taxes, and I thought, well, this now is reaching a point uh, of being ludicrous, and I came up with the thought of playing by the rules, and it seems like in many facets of society, and people that you uh, put in the public trust positions just exhibit bad behavior and don't play by the rules. And what kind of response have you gotten? Uh, a lot of people, of course your friends will always say they like what you do, but, I, but there are other people that don't know me that have heard it and responded and the comment I get the most is that's exactly how I feel. Um, people I think are just getting fed up with what goes on and you think uh, you think you've put some people in positions that are that are going to do the right thing, and somehow the mentality I, it just seems the mentality changes when they when they are given these jobs, and all of a sudden it becomes no it doesn't become statesmanlike anymore it becomes well what can I do for me or what can I do for my party or when it should be hey we're America what are you going to do for us you know and that's the way it should be. Uh, the song itself, you probably have, and at least it feels like it, because it feels very now. Have you been writing it and you keep doing it, or uh, is it just a coincidence that some of the things you've pointed out just keep replicating themselves? <laughs> <laughs> I guess I guess history repeats itself, right? right? These things keep happening. Uh, I've been, I, I keep jotting, in fact, I've got probably five more verses for it, but... Uh, because I wanted to address other things too, like I didn't address health care, I didn't address lots mm -hmm. of other things. Um, but maybe it's a timeless kind of topic because these things keep, and I wish it weren't, I wish somehow we could put a stop to some of this. But. Well, you know, John, it's also not bipartisan. I mean, it is bipartisan. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, it, it seems like you can pick on Republicans and Democrats and conservatives and just about everybody and, and very far left because I didn't hear you call any names, you called no. out behavior. That's it. Yes. It, that's not, it wasn't meant to be a political statement. It's meant to be, why, why, why is this erosion of values and morals mm. occurring in this country? And I think the vast majority of Americans don't like it don't maybe have the public voice to speak up about it, uh, but wish there was something they could do or something people in power could do to just to change the direction a bit to where it's not quite this way. What do you think people can do? 
Well, maybe the first thing you could do is uh, kick everybody out of office. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> and bring in some new scoundrels. I mean, I mean, there would still be scoundrels, but maybe they wouldn't be tainted as, as right. tainted as... Uh, no. Uh, these things, I think all things start in the home and at a local level. Hmm. And so it's, it's people just being aware of their own... Uh, integrity, their own values, their own lesson plan, uh, the way the youth of today are brought up uh, to instill values. I don't think any kid is taught in school to cheat, and yet here they go into professional sports and they cheat. Mm -hmm. uh, I Very don't think anybody in school or in college is taught to lie and to think only of themselves and to say, well, thank you for this position, but I think I'm going to take a little more out of it. Mm. I don't think they're taught that. Uh, how does that happen? I, I don't know. It, it, but well, they get away with it. And they get, that's it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, they're, they're enabled. They're, they're unrepentant for it, and, uh, and it goes unpunished in most cases. Well, Play by the Rules is very popular on YouTube.com. If you haven't seen it, you just saw a little clip of it there, uh, click on it. It's a lot of fun to watch. John Chaffee is a wonderful lyricist. He's writing about something from his heart. He's channeling, apparently, from what other Americans are feeling. What's your next song? There are uh, about four more I'm working along. Oh, boy. Uh, and uh, I'll give you the title of one of them. Okay. I Feel Like Dorothy. Okay. Why is it entitled that? Because I'm walking down this crooked, broken road, and I look over here and I see these brainless people. And I look over here and I see heartless people. And I look here, and, well, there are some people that have no courage, no courage of their... Mm. And all I'm doing is looking for the truth. I'm hoping... Well, there's a curtain up there. Maybe I can get to that curtain and find the truth. Very interesting. Something like that. Very interesting. <laughs> John Chaffee, very colorful guy. I'm so glad you dropped by the strategy room. I hope Thank you'll you. do it again. Thank uh, you. Strat Bratz are loving you. I'm, I'm seeing some emails here. People are, are in support of this. I saw a wave from April up on our Skype wall up there. Uh, <laughs> so, so glad to have you. Again, come back. All of you, thanks so much for being here today. I'll see you back here tomorrow. We're going to hit a commercial break and then more live strategy room right here on foxnews.com. Have a great Friday Eve, people. It's Thursday.